Tree Hills! Hello Vikings, my name is Joe Reber. And I'm Aitza Mohammed. And welcome to the third installment of your Viking Report. Kicking us off this time is a presidential election. Donald J. Trump has been elected the 45th President of the United States and will be inaugurated into office on January 20th, 2017. President-elect Trump won 306 electoral votes compared to Hillary Clinton's 232. CNN made the announcement of Donald Trump's victory early morning on Wednesday, November 9th. Let's take a look at which stage won by which candidates and some of the fallout from the anti-Trump protesters throughout the country. We are going to make this decision now. The Fox News decision desk has called Pennsylvania for Donald Trump. This means that Donald Trump will be the 45th president of the United States, winning the most unreal, surreal <laughs> election we have ever seen. Before the election, students in Mr. Bachelor and Mrs. Rosendahl civics classes here at Persephone Hills held a mock presidential debate in the auditorium, with the students in the class playing the parts of certain presidential candidates. Chris and Jeremy portrayed Donald Trump, Aitana and Sabrina portrayed Secretary Clinton, Liam and Tyler portrayed Bill Stein, and Ben and Evan portrayed Gary Johnson. Our camera operators were able to catch some of the debates on film. Education is the cornerstone of our nation. Without a great education system, this country has no future. And over the past eight years, our education system has only declined more and more thanks to Ms. Hillary Clinton and President Obama. We need change. We spend more money per student than any other major established nation, yet our students still rank towards the bottom. And I will change this. By funding school choice, we allow our low-income students to take their future into their hands and to escape from federally failing schools. Now, I've heard that Persephone Hills is a pretty great school district, so I have a feeling that you guys are pretty informed on politics and this election. So, I'm going to ask, uh, does anybody know anything about Mr. Gary Johnson? Uh, I can't trust him with my foreign affairs. That sounds like a pretty informed voter. Uh, does, does anyone know anything about Miss Jill Stein? You? <laughs> she wishes to crash the American economy. He also sounds like a pretty informed voter. I'm pretty happy with what I'm hearing. Uh, does anyone know anything about Miss Hillary Clinton? Oh, nice. Uh, I know that she looked good in an orange jumpsuit in jail. Hey. Oh. 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 Lastly, does anyone know anything about me, Mr. Donald Trump? Oh, okay. uh, he's a patriot, he's a genius, and he's someone that will make America great again. <laughs> exactly. I am the person that this country needs to make America great again for everyone. Recently, our athletic teams here at Par Hills have done quite well for themselves. Last week, our girls varsity soccer team won the NJSIAA state finals. Furthermore, our football team has been doing extremely well this year, advancing to the state finals in the NJSIAA tournament in the North 2 Group 2 division. Our marching band has also won a regional final. Now to the weatherman, Nikki Farrow. Hi, my name is Nikki Farrow, and I'm your meteorologist for the Viking News Report. On Monday, November 21st, it will be four, a high of 47 degrees with a low of 32 degrees. There will be a 0% chance of rain, and it will be sunny. On Tuesday, November 22nd, it will be a high of 52 degrees and a low of 33 degrees with 0% chance of showers and sunny. On Wednesday, November 23rd, it will be a high of 55 degrees, a low of 41 degrees, and a 10% chance of raining with partly cloudy. Um, on Thursday, November 24th, there will be a high of 56 degrees and a low of 37 with a 20% chance of raining and it will be partly cloudy again. On Friday, November 25th, it will be a high of 55 degrees with a low of 38 
and a 10% chance of raining, and it'll be mostly sunny. On Saturday, November 26th, it'll be a high 54 degrees, a low 37 degrees, and a 20% chance of raining, and partly cloudy. Thank you. For your Viking Report, I'm Joe Reber. And I'm Isaiah Mohammed. Go Vikings! <laughs>